What is going on guys, it's your boy Crane here, bringing you Road to Olmec with Crane, and this game we're playing right now, it's called Spelunky, it's a roguelike platformer game, uh, in which the, the goal of the game is to get to the final of the caves, uh, the final of the jungle, the final of the ice caves, and the final of the temple, which are the levels of the game, and beat the final boss, there's a secret level that I'm not gonna bother with right now, because, because this is Road to Olmec, not Road to Hell, and yeah, I'm just gonna play this game because it re got released on Steam uh, a couple days ago actually, and uh, I bought it because it's a really cool game, I really liked it, I played like two hours of it, so I'm not great, don't expect like the best play from me. If you want to check out someone who's really good at the game, check uh, Michael, Michael A.L. Fox, which is I think the highest scoring gamer right now, or Northern Lion, who is a really entertaining gamer, and he's actually pretty decent at this game. Uh, not that great, I'm just gonna play and try to get better over time, and we're gonna get better together, I'm gonna record a shit ton of this stuff, because it's, it's an amazing game and it records really well on my computer. And, uh, yeah, as I said, uh, roguelike, so everything is randomly generated. There's a mode that's called Daily Challenge, which gives every player in the world the same map once a day. And they can only play it once a day. And uh, the whoever gets the highest score gets on top of the leaderboard. And, yeah, it's just like a score attack. Uh, the game's real fun. I'm going to show the mechanics off right now. So we go into this cave, and the walls start shifting. Hopefully um, I don't have too much echo on my mic. I might. Because I am locked up in my room, because I don't want anyone to bother me while I'm recording. And uh, there might be a little bit of echo, because my walls are bouncy. <laughs> so as you can see, we're in the mines 1-1. There's, as I said, four different levels. Uh, we have the mines, we have the um, we have the ice caves, the jungle, and the temple. Not in that order, though. And uh, the, tom the temple is the last one. And there you fight the final boss, uh, quote-unquote, because it's not really the final boss. Spoiler alert. But, uh, yeah, it's pretty fun. Uh, so, the basic gist of the game is get, get as much gold as you can and try to beat Olmec. It's just like, you're this uh, Indiana Jones guy who's uh, just trying to get a bunch of gold. And it's fun. It's a really fun game. I really recommend you guys buy it. It's, I think, $14 on the Steam uh, store right now. And it's so worth it. Like, you don't even know how much content you get for this. Like, I have already spent, like, a couple hours on this. I, have, I know people who have spent over, like, 200 hours on it already. And it's, it's, that's people who would like got the pre-release and stuff, like YouTube gamers and stuff, who got the pre-release, and they got addicted, man. Like, this game is fucking addicting. I spent like, I don't know, so much time just thinking about how I, how I was going to play this game, and how I was just going to record it. And it records really well on any computer, too, so if, you, if you're interested in doing YouTube stuff, this is a great game if you like it. Oh, that arrow trap just fucked the fucking butt up. So yeah, there's different types of enemies, uh, when you're in the caves, nothing's really that scary. I am playing with a PS3 controller, by the way, I don't know if I mentioned that. Oh, that was bad. So yeah, you take fall damage if you do something stupid like that. I tried to go into that thing over there, but it didn't work out. Uh, sometimes if you break pots, there's uh, enemies in them that contain a spider, this one contains a sapphire. Uh, so yeah, there's different type of score point thingies, and there's this thing right here, which is a dog, because I have it set as a dog. You can set it up as a woman, a man, or a dog. I like the dog, so I'm just gonna use the dog. And it works as a health up, basically. It's a damsel. Well, the what the fuck? Well, I'll throw a dog at you, I don't give a fuck. Uh, yeah, it works as a, a health up. If you get it to the end, you get a health up every time you, you beat the level. And yeah, that's the point of the game. Just try to get to the end of each floor as much gold as you can and don't die, basically. Because it is permadeath, which means you lose everything if you, if you die. So, I'm not good at this game, like I said. So I'm just gonna try to do my best, not promise anything though, because, yeah. So, this game is, like, really propense of having really funny moments though, like, you can get, you can get a um, runs where you just, like, have a really unfortunate chain of events that just kills you, like, in one second. You can have, like, five points of health, and you make one mistake and everything just goes to shit real quick. So, that's one part of the fun of the game, in my opinion. Uh, these cobwebs are really annoying. They, like, stop you and me there. I want the damage, though, because I need the health, because I took, like, the worst damage of all time. Dog stuck in the fucking cobweb. The hell? Dog? Okay. I had to hit him. I had to. Uh, this one, this thing right here is an idol. If you take it, uh, a boulder in the Jones style will come down and uh, chase you around, but I don't want to do that. Cause there's a shopkeeper down here, and if I do that, the boulder's gonna hit him, and he's gonna call me a terrorist. And I don't like that because having a shopkeeper being mad at you is like one of the worst things that can happen because they go crazy and they have a shotgun. 
So that's not great. That spider suck. Let's see what we have over here. Uh, these are things are called the climbing gloves. I'm gonna buy those. And I'm gonna buy the spike shoes because those things are really useful. Uh, so yeah, you can use your money to buy stuff like that. And it's pretty fun. Uh, let's just go to the next floor and see what we can find. Hopefully I will be able to get to the jungle on this run. The farthest I've gotten is the ice caves. Which is pretty... Ooh, there's a cape. How much is it? Oh, I might come back for that. Oh, I want to go to the other side because there's a crate. Uh, you have two types of consumables in this game. You have bombs. Oh, the, the widget is here. I'll explain that in a second. In a second. Uh, you have bombs and you have ropes. Uh, you can use ropes to climb back up. And you can use bombs to blow shit up. Like, like you might expect. Oh, man. Where's the key, though? Like, I, I want to find the key first. So I can use this chest to get something called the Ujedi, which is going to help me do two things. First of all, the active effect is that you're going to be able to see uh, where the gems are hidden in the ground. And uh, I'm going to have to... Yeah, because the gravity hits you and it hurts. Um, so you're going to be able to see the gems and you're going to be able to find the, something called the black market once you go to back down to the jungle. And if you get to the black market, um, you can actually get something called... Uh, well, I'll, I'll explain that later if we get to the black market because I don't think we will and I don't want to spoil anything. If you want to watch someone go to the black market like every run, uh, like, like I said, go watch Michael A.L. Fox on YouTube. He's a really, really good player of this game. Northern Lion also goes to the black market pretty quickly. Uh, yeah, I don't, I can't think really of anyone else. So I'm just going to drop my damsel. Let me just do this a little bit smart. Smart. Please, oh, uh, thank you, climbing gloves. Okay, climbing gloves uh, let you attach yourself to any kind of surface, uh, like um, this kind of these walls right here. So instead of just grabbing onto the edge, you can just grab onto any type of wall, and it's really, really useful. It's one of the best. Uh, it's one of the best uh, things. And by things, I mean uh, the, the fuck items. Thank you, God. Okay, so I'm gonna drop this chest right here, and I'm gonna buy the cape. What the cave is going to allow me to do is I'm going to be able to float like so and that makes it so I don't take as much damage. I mean, I don't take any damage if I use the cave from falling damage, that is. And also, first of all, let's like, activate this trap with the chest because uh, arrows do two damage. They're really fucking hard. There you go. Uh, we're just going to get the damsel. We've got to find the key for the chest so we can get the Ujedi. But yeah, as I said, you don't want to get hit by- Oh my god, no! Fuck, okay, uh, fuck the dog. Fuck the dog, fuck the dog, fuck the dog. Oh my god, no, this is bad. This is real bad. The ghost is coming. Fuck. Okay, got the Ujedi. Grab the fucking dog. Run, like a little bit- Oh my god. Get away! Oh my fucking spider. Okay, I need to run. Okay, oh, the ghost, right there. If you spend uh, two and a half minutes on each floor, on uh, I mean on every floor he appears. But if you spend two and a half, man, oh, fuck my skin is crawling. Um, this is a special floor. I'll explain the ghost in a sec. So, uh, for the ghost, I don't want to buy a kiss. For the ghost, if you spend more than two and a half minutes on a floor, he spawns in and uh, basically kills you. I had to use a, a rope there because I didn't want to get hit. I only have four HP. And I want to get to the forest on this one, so I have to be a little bit careful. There's an altar. I'm gonna sacrifice my dog, I think. Uh, so yeah, he kills you in one hit. Uh, this floor, it's called... Uh, I feel my screen crawling, I think it's it. It's cool. And there's a lot of spiders here, which is annoying. Because... I don't know, it's good and it's bad. Like, every special floor is harder than a normal floor. But it also means... Um, they're gonna be able to get a special item. In this uh, floor, there's a bunch of big spiders. And there's a... Uh, yeah, there's a bunch of big spiders, which means uh, you can get something called paste, which I'm gonna get right here. Oh man, I don't know if I wanna... I fucked that up, I fucked that... Uh, run! <laughs> okay. Um, so many big spiders. So many of them. <sighs> Fuck me. Okay, jump. I have spike shoes, right? Yeah, I have spike shoes. Okay, that's paste right there. I'm gonna rescue this guy. So we got a new character unlocked, I'm gonna use her next time just because I just unlocked her. And she's gonna work as a little helper for now. I don't know what to do here. 
Well, she's gonna go kill herself, apparently. Well, she killed the, the snake, so that's good. I'm just gonna jump on these guys. I got paste. I got three paste. I mean, you can only get a, a maximum of one. She's gonna, she's gonna get me killed. She got herself killed. I'm gonna sacrifice her on the altar. Because you, you sacrifice bodies on the altar to get items. Okay, you need to die. Thank you, Spike Shoes. Like, I swear to God. Best thing that ever happened. No, I wanna pick you up. I wanna... Why can't I pick you up? I can't pick you... I make her jump instead of picking her up. Okay. Fuck her then. Fuck her. I don't care. I don't. Alright, you dead. You dead. Let me get this gold. There's 500 gold right here. Uh, so, our objective right now is try to get to 50,000 gold so we can go to the black market and maybe buy the, the item that's uh, for sale there. And when, once we do that, we're gonna be able to do awesome stuff. But, oh my god, terrible chills. Okay, I need to find the exit, like, right here. I didn't find it. Oh my god, the spider. Okay, fuck this floor. Okay, we took some awful damage at the end there, but... We got to the forest. This is the tunnel, man. He's gonna construct uh, shortcuts for you. For you. Uh, so what do you want? His equipment broke. 10,000? Yeah, sure. Uh, he's gonna finish up uh, building the path to the forest, so every time I wanna go to the forest instead of the mines, I can just do that. But I don't really care that much, I just wanted to get that over with, because it's annoying to have that cutscene. Or not that... Damn, this guy's fucking scary. Um, it's not a cutscene, but... Uh... But yeah, that little dialogue right there. So this is the forest, or the jungle, or whatever. Oh my god, no. Uh, it's a little bit harder than the caves, but it's not as hard. I mean, it's not that hard. But, yeah, I just want to be careful around here. If you, that thing right there, if you throw your damsel to it, I think it will take you to a special level, I think I heard. So, but, I don't know if I want to do that right now, because I want to, I want to see if the Ujidai takes me to the special level I want to go to, which is a black market, as I said. Uh, so, yeah, there's a crate right here, I'm going to open up. Oh, my geese. Oh, web gun. Oh. We are gonna use a web gun. Oh, whoa. Yo. Web gun is pretty useful sometimes, but it's a shitty item. Most of the time. Oh, nope, nope, nope. Okay, uh, jump on him. We are gonna take this idol because it's pretty easy to get. We have the cape. And we are gonna take it to the end so I can get some more gold. Even if I go to the black market, I don't think it's gonna be worth it because... I have like no money because I gave it all to the tunnel man. Okay, uh, do your thing. There you go. Do your thing. Where is the damsel? I didn't find it. Well, that's my gold. That's 10,000 gold right there. I don't think the black market's on this level either. I don't want to use it, my ropes just trying to find the damsel, so I'm just gonna bounce to the jungle part too. And see how that goes. So, uh, pretty good run. For yet. Ah, oh, fucking rushing water. I hate this level. It's full piranhas, man. Oh, man. I don't want to die. That one hit. One shot hits you. One shot kills you. Uh, yeah. Oh, man. Did I blow him up? No, but I also fucked that up. Oh, that's going to kill him. Nope. No, it's not. I'm just going to take you and get the fuck off because I need the health. Even if I find an altar, I'm not going to sacrifice him because that would be a foolish... Foolish, foolish decision for me to make. I need this crate. The dog is gonna heal himself to a plant. I know that shit. Did he die? Nope. He's still uh, running around. Choose back here. Oh my god. Okay, you can kill himself. You can kill yourself if you want, dog. I don't really care too much. Huh? I got gold. I thought I heard the um, Ujedi blinking, but. That was not the case, and as you can see, rushing water, piranhas everywhere. It's not good. So, what we're we gonna do now? Dog probably killed himself. Oh, uh, uh, I didn't hear any blinking. So we're just gonna get the fuck out of here. I just wanna get as far as I can while not dying. So I don't wanna risk anything, I'm just gonna do my thing. I can see it. Really? Like, I'm getting all the special levels. This is bullshit. Like, I can't see a sh Like I said, I can't see a thing. Fuck you, bat. Fuck you, bat. 
my god. There's an idol, but Torch is way more important right now. Oh man. This is not good. I hate this level. Oh my god, the fucking black market's right here. Oh, this is not good because there's a... Die. Thank you. The black market's down here. There's a scarab too. Fuck, I wanna get the scarab. Okay. Oh man. Black market's probably down, but I'm gonna die real soon. I need health. I need honey. That's what I need. Oh man. Oh, that was blinking over here, right? Right? Yeah. Oh, that is blinking. Okay, I have spike shoes, so I killed that guy in one hit. Okay. We don't. We don't want to hit this frog. Oh my god, he's gonna blow up. Okay, uh, that worked out. Okay. Would you die? It's not blinking anymore. To the right? Would you die? Oh, it's probably to the right, yeah. Yeah? It's definitely to the right. I jump on you and kill you. What the fuck? Where is it? Black market. It's probably up here. What the fuck? I don't get it. I really don't. This is not the way to go, is it? Oh, man. Fuck it. Big money. Big money. Oh. Oh, I got the price. I got the medic. Yeah. Okay, I got the medic. This is good. What the fuck? I won! You piece of shit! I won! Oh man. Fucking asshole. Damn it! Well. I got killed by a shopkeeper way up there. <laughs> oh man, I, I, I won though! Like, the hell? Oh, it's because I used the medic on the wall! Well then. <laughs> that sucks. Uh, yeah, so that's gonna make it for this episode, guys. We, we got to the jungle, it was pretty cool. So you got a glimpse of, of what this game is about. It is a pretty cool game, guys. Don't get me wrong, it's an awesome game. So if you wanna pick it up on Steam, as I said, uh, be my guest to buy it. It's an awesome game. If you wanna play, you're gonna spend a lot of hours on this. And expect to see a lot, of, a lot more of this game on my channel. So, once again, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace out, guys. Take care.